comes a new challenger. They're all fired up. We're almost underway. The top player is here. Time to play. Round one. Fight. Here we go. What are these fighters going to do? Waiting for the opponent to make the first move. Locks the jump in. Okay, we're in the early stages of the round. Both fighters have plenty of health. Where is this match going to go? Hmm, how are they going to deal damage? What's the play here? Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Adds on a bit extra to that to make sure the opponent walks away with a full plate. Got their eye on the air. Throws them. What's next? The drink levels at four. All inhibitions are out the window. Medium kick hit. Player one in there. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. Round two. Fight. Time for a drink. This round is so important, you can feel the intensity in the air. Does a good job of pushing back. Gets out of the corner and creates some distance. Both fighters want to establish themselves early on. All right, what's coming up next? Both fighters have plenty of drive to work with, but how they make their approach will be key. It'll be interesting to see how both players utilize their drive gauge to dictate the terms of the match. Player one, holding, hits them with a stop and bop. Player one, the punish counter gives them a great opening here to do big damage. I send down by Raku. Play time's over. That's not good. Ooh, they're going to feel that. Here we go. Player one is in a pretty good situation with the meter event. Drink level max out. This party's getting crazy. Charges forward. No super art on deck. No death. life left. How will they close it out? Secret art. This is gonna kill. Yes, no yes. doubt about it. Oh, closes it out. No way. Player one Win. is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, right boy. back into the rematch. We ain't even close to done yet. Denies the jump in. Decides to buff up while they can. Plenty of time left. How's the match gonna play out? Both fighters are pretty much unscathed. Mm, how are they going to deal damage? What's the play here? Puts one in the pocket. Starts with a jump in. You can open up chances to do big damage by fading something out, getting that opening, and then jumping in. Had the radar up and running. Knockdown. This is the perfect range to reach out and tag them with something. Smart blow. That'll do more damage than usual. From up above. Block. Getting dipsy with the devil inside. A super art? The super doesn't hit. Burns a bar to unleash the storm. Sakai Fu Hassan. Player one will look to apply pressure. Closes with the throw. Hitting him with the smart stuff. Player two with a big first round pickup. Can they close it out? Gets a risky buff in. The next round is beginning. What's gonna happen now? Opts for the free flow kicks to get a drink in. Both fighters want to establish themselves early on. Jump. Drink level max out. This party's getting crazy. Drive brushes that off and keeps going. Very slick with the combo. Breaks their guard with the throw. Here comes the mix-up. Looking for a chance. Player one will look to apply pressure here. Medium kick. Sai Hacho in there. This is the final round. I'm Expect to see some fireworks. Final round. Fight. Time for a drink. There's a change of size. 
They're trading attack. Meet them air to air. Good judgment there. One flash anti-air. Plenty of help. Full gauges. Let's go. Target combo into... Amazing! Wow, that throw did some juicy damage. Player one can't let this simmer. They gotta start cooking. Three slow strikes. The drive impact doesn't work. Ugh, scuffle. Here we go. Set up with the jump in. They think this time to bust this out? Is it over? Will they survive? Such a lovely face. Oh, so close. The next moves are gonna be crucial. No hesitation or regret. Hit them with that NSFW. My Perfect damage calculation. No doubt about it. It is over. Player one clinches the win. But that could have been anyone's game. No way we could have called that. It's not over yet. Let's believe it's time for that run back. Jump! Barely blocks the jump in. Breaks the block with a throw. Good work staying in throw range there. Things are slow going right now. But we may see someone speed things up soon. Hmm, how are they going to deal damage? What's the play here? Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunities. This is where things will get interesting as the damage starts to pile up on both fighters. Okay, they trade hits. Box him with a target. Takes a trip. Jumps in. This is a critical point of the round where they just need to go for it. Look, they were right to be on guard there. Roses with the throw. Hitting them with the smart stuff. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. I guess they both like jumping. This round is so important. You can feel the intensity in the air. Good job blocking the jumping. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Blocking a jump in attack means you're at a disadvantage, so they should be looking to anti air instead. They both have full drive gauges to work with. Both fighters will have to decide whether they want to go with an all out offense powered by their drive or play it safe and conservative. You've got to be mindful of reaching jump ins at this range. Lots of food hop bank and plenty of avenues to race through. Both fighters have a full super meter on deck. The winner will be the one who manages it best. Uses the target combo with a hit them with a stop and pop. Goes for the Sakai Suazan. Vintage jury. A quick breather. Knocked him out of the air. Oh, uh oh. Devil Song. Taking chunks out of his back. Combo finishes it. Gotta hand it to both of our fighters. They put on a real clinic for us. Challenger! Ho oh, ho, looks like these two have more beef than a Philly cheesesteak. All right, you ready? Don't expect me to be a pushover. Round one. Fight. Let's see what they try to do here in the first round. Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Below heavy hit. 
Close up some damage with a long reaching attack. Goes for the fireball. You know their fireball game is solid because they're only throwing it when their opponent can't jump them. Was looking for that jump attack. Very solid corner. Shot. From up above. Life lead opens up. Caught in the crossover. KO. Player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight. Blossom. They've piled up the knowledge. Now, how are they going to use it? Combo with the target combo. Early round decisions are so important to set. Ooh, lands a rising uppercut. Player one chases, crushes that off, and keeps going. Shows a medium kick. Connects with medium kick. Going in. Lands the back throw. Time to go to work. Pops him with a short of you. Sneaks in the throw. This is the final round. Expect to see some fire. Uses their drive gauge. The last round. It's now or never. Looking to follow up. Ooh, lands a rising uppercut. Plenty of help. Full gauges. Let's go. Player one can't let this simmer. He gotta start cooking. Tries to act quickly, but with the attack. Catches them out. Noticeable life lead is a cup. This is gonna hurt. Goes all in with the uppercut. Keeps them out. Do they have what it takes? The shield burns out. Oh, you're grounded. Player one comes out on top of that fierce battle. About a show that match had it all. They're still hungry. Both sides stepping up for the rematch. We're here in the first round. Which one of them will let their fists do the talk? Connect with medium kick. From up above, you can open up chances to do big damage by baiting something out, getting that opening, and then jumping in. Player one chases them down. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunities. The super art finds its mark. Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Blocking a jump in attack means you're at a disadvantage, so they should be looking to anti air instead. The jump in catches them. Mm, taking stock. In a dire situation, they can't afford any mistakes. Knockdown. They need to rely on their instincts here. Goes with a safe KO. Player two picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. Round two. Fight. Immediate jump in. This round is so important, you can feel the intensity in the air. This fight is just underway. What kind of game plan do they have? Combo with the target combo. Plenty of life left. A full drive gauge to work with. They have tons of rising uppercut. Player one needs to use the threat of the corner. Blocking that drive impact isn't going to work. Still scrapping for control of the space. Ooh, lands a rising uppercut. Barely blocks the jump in. Goes all in with the uppercut. Are we gonna see a comeback here? to the corner, willing to risk it for the overdrive. Chuck the fireball to continue their hold over their nose. Any mistake here is going to be fatal. What's it going to be? Guess it's a perfect fireball. Oh, critical art now. Closes it out. Last round, people. Both fighters got to go all in from this point. Fight round. Fight. Opens with the fireball. Goes airborne. Connects with the throw. Medium kick hit. Fires a blast. Player one has the super gauge advantage. What separates the good from the great in this game is smart gauge management. Goes all in with the uppercut. Keeps them out. Here comes the corner pressure. What's next? 
The drive impact doesn't work. Both absolutely refusing to give up ground. The overhead denied. Are they going to be able to come back and snatch victory from the jaws of defeat? Still excellent block. Back into the corner. What setup do they have? Oh, yo, Ross, super hit. There's a burnout. Medium kick. Layer one comes out on top of that fierce battle. Talk about a show. That match had it all. a new challenger. Our fighters are pumping themselves up and are raring to go. Who is going to come out on top in this fight? No mercy for you. Round one. Fight. The fight's now underway. This is Vicious with the play-by-play. Goes for the surprise rush in. Okay, takes them all the way to the corner. Player one in that dangerous burnout state. They need to hold out. Player one has used up all of their drive gauge. Oh, can they survive this badly timed burnout? Got to add a little super juice into this combo for more damage. Drive gauge finally recovers. Scrapping it out up close. Both fighters planning something? Experience in there! Player one on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. He tries to set the tone with that charging attack. The next round is beginning. What's gonna happen now? Get backed into the corner with pressure building. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for a side switch. Gotta be careful not to whip at this range. From upstairs! Corbola! Ah, uh, burnout activated! Up for the arrow! In there! Last round, people! Both fighters gotta go all in from this point! Fight round! Fight! Fire Break through! The last round! It's now or never! Check with them! Were they looking to connect with an overdrive art from this situation? Still willing to risk it for the overdrive! Okay, here we go. Chases them down. Player one can't use drive anymore. Burns out. Up for the arrow. What crowns them from above? Wait more fuel for the fire. Cook them up. Wait, what? Are they actually dead? He doesn't kill. They're still in this. Fools them and locks them in him. Are you kidding me? Player one. To fight for that one. No shortage of drama. It's not over yet. Best believe it's time for that run back. Sets up with the jump in. Check with the medium. Three gloves. That's some big juicy damage on that counter hit. Player one has the life lead. There's still a lot of fighting to be had. It's anyone's match. Player one is in burnout. Drives off the table. We have one player in burnout state, which means they'll have to continue to fight temporarily without using any driver reliant move. Player, this is a huge chance to make a few. Heats it up with a combo into super. They're jostling for the dominant position KO. 
player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight. Charges forward. Jump. Counters with the knee jump. Nice read. Medium kick hit. Is this early super kind of going on the offensive? Even fishing to get meter is risky in this game and may affect how they approach the neutral. Resource management is the key to winning. Player one can't use any drive moves without burning out. Crowns them from above. Player two, there's a burnout. Get over. What a finish! This is the final round. Expect to see some fireworks. Is that it, Final round. Fools him and locks him in embrace. Player one drops below on gauge stock, but a good call to take that round. We have a super art on deck. Expect us. There's a burnout. Player one up for the arrow. <laughs> Perfect execution with the anti air. Sets up with the jump in. Let the Chernobyl rip. What were they thinking? Oh, here we go. Player two. Needs to take advantage of off of me! Totsugeki to the face! Noticeable life lead chases them down! Switch sides! Got him! Mix up time! Very nice, three blow! Turns out, it is over! I've seen a lot of fights in my day, but nothing even comes close to this one. Best believe it's time for that run back. Jumps in. Amnesia. Player two chases them down. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can take some big chances to do damage here. Player one has used up all of their drive gauge. They need to hold out. Player one in that dangerous burnout state. Get the with a super arc connect. I wonder how both fighters will adapt to what we've seen so far. Knockdown! Player two creates a good corner opportunity. Three glove! What's their game plan here at this critical stage? They're jostling for the dominant position in the corner, and the throw ends the round. Player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight! Grabs them with the embrace. They've piled up the knowledge. Now, how are they going to use it? Charges forward. Jumps up. Hits up the counter. Experiencing burnout. Player one has an empty drive gauge. This is a very precarious situation. Out of drive gauge. Now is the time. Big opportunity coming. Throwing some shade. Up for the arrow. They push their way out of the corner. Got him! Mix up time! They're in range! A super art? Will this super art do anything? More fuel! Flatline zone! Player 2 brings it home! Let's see if they can build themselves a streak! 